Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in to another Simple Easy Art video. Today we're going to be doing the CR7 logo. Let's start out with the C, and we're going to start with doing two circles. One's going to be the outer edge, the other is going to be the inner edge. So let's go ahead and mark where the circle is going to end here on the top and the bottom. I'm just going to make the outline with the green marker. Stop right at that mark and adjust the compass so it comes in and we're going to make the inner part of that C bring it around. Use the straight edge to finish up the C. Now we're going to want to make sure that the, le the rest of the letters are exactly the same size. So I'm going to use the straight edge, bring that across. And then just measure the C, and make a mark that's exactly the same size on the other side, and then bring that line across. And that way all the letters will be the same size. So we we'll use this to draw the R. We're going to want to make sure the R is the same width as the C. Now get your straight edge and mark the inner portion of that R on the top and the inner portion on the bottom. We'll just make a mark there. Now grab your compass and adjust it so it starts at the top line and when you swing it down it hits the bottom line. Now put the compass in the same spot and adjust it. So now you're doing the outer edge of the R and it's the same thing. You want to hit the top line and then bring it all the way down. And now you can use the straight edge to finish the bottom section of the arm. Now we can go ahead and get started on the 7. The one thing to remember about the 7 is the tip of the 7 here comes out at an angle and that continues into that little mark above the 7. So we're going to want to keep that in mind later. So let's make that straight edge parallel to the top line that we use as a guide. This section of the 7 comes out underneath the R, so we're going to angle it to come underneath the R. Bring that up. And it's a really sharp tip at the bottom, so we're going to want to make it meet there and then just bring it out towards the top. And that little mark above the 7, we want to make it at the same angle that the tip of the 7 was that we did. And there's the outline. Now we can go ahead and finish up outlining the rest of it with the marker. So you're going to want it was before, so you should see a little hole there and then just adjust the compass to get back to the lines that you did earlier. Bring it around. And now we should be able to use the straight edge to finish up the rest of the outlines.
here, remember to place the straight edge so it's in line with the tip of that seven. So it's almost like a continuation of that little line. Now grab your red marker and we can outline the seven. And again, we're going to place it on that line that's continued from the mark above the seven. And we're done with the outline. So now is the easy part. We can go ahead and color it in. And again, I use this piece of paper just to prevent myself from smudging the rest of the drawing. The ink is still drying from the marker, so until it's dry, you always run that risk of smudging the rest of the, the drawing. So just to be safe, I use that piece of paper so I don't ruin it. Now I think the 7 came out a little bit too thin, so I'm going to use the straight edge to just make it a little bit thicker. We're not going to make the tip thicker, we're going to make more the top end a little bit thicker. So let's bring it from the tip, just bring it out just a little bit. Yeah, I think that looks a little bit better. So that should do it. That's the CR7 logo. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll be adding a couple more videos this week. Thanks again for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later.